When Boston Dynamics introduced the fully electric Atlas in April 2024, it seemed like a death blow to hydraulics for humanoids. But now, two buzzy startups are going against the grain and betting on hydraulics with cutting-edge tech they say overcomes limitations. Vancouver-based Sanctuary AI is boasting its next-generation robotic hand with 21 degrees of freedom. The startup says miniaturized hydraulic valves deliver superior power density compared to electric systems. Sanctuary engineers tested the valves to withstand more than 2 billion cycles without leakage or degradation. The design uses food-safe oil. The new hand, which integrates with Sanctuary's flagship humanoid Phoenix, has one less degree of freedom than the Generation 3 Tesla Optimus hand. However, Sanctuary's hand is geared toward tasks requiring greater strength, including tasks in semiconductor manufacturing and electronics assembly. Meanwhile, Clone Robotics, which operates out of the US and Poland, is going viral for its torso to androids human-like movements that remind people of the HBO show Westworld. Clone says its android is powered by water and electricity. Torso 2's white transparent skin shields 910 synthetic muscle fibers that animate 164 degrees of freedom. Using water alleviates concerns that previously made hydraulic robots unfeasible for humanoids. Will hydraulics give Sanctuary and Clone an edge against robots from the likes of Tesla, Agility Robotics, Figure, Ubitech, Unitree, and 1X Technologies? Or will it be the hill they die on?